Welcome back guys to episode 3 of Prison Architect with your boy Risky and today we're going to be putting in the last bit of stuff before we start uh before we bring in all of the, all of the prisoners so we're going to get the the utilities in along with the uh the lights so we're going to start doing that now and I'll show you where I'm going to put them all so the power stations are going to go here and the comparators around them. And... Then the water station is going to go up here. And here. And then I'm going to quickly connect the two water stations to each other because that doesn't cause any issues and two it's just a good way to transport a lot of water all over which I think all, you only need the one water station for the entire place but I, 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 I usually put in more than one just to be not necessarily safe but just to be uh just thorough and then so that's gonna be the water and then the well that's not all of the water obviously because there's more to it but we're gonna try and get to the point where we start bringing in some uh, prisoners pretty quickly today so we're gonna take the electrical cables off of each of the power plants and go in all four directions Like a so. And then make a square like this. For all four corners. I'm only going to do like two corners just so that you guys get the idea of what I'm doing. And then uh, we'll finish it up in just a second. So for these cells, we're just running straight across like this. Just so that it gets power to all of the parts. And then also one right there just to make sure. And then for this, we're just running straight there. There. And then connecting all of these up. <clears throat> and connecting these to this wire. And these there. And then the water situation is like this. These two are just gonna run straight down like this. And like that. And then these get covered up here. Not covered up, but get placed in there. cables because we need electrical to the water stations so that they start pumping the water because the water seems to be done and then we'll just continue doing that and then for these what I did what I'm going to do is run straight down the middle of the shower sections with large pipes and then also all the way around because I have a feeling that this is going to be 
necessary at one point or another. And then also down this way. Okay, so that gives us water to the showers uh, for the most part. And then obviously we have to and place down all of these, all of them, and then this there, and this across there, and there, and like this. And we'll do the same for all of the other, or for the other set, set of cells. And then these right here, I believe I am just gonna have to do this. And then take these and just run them right the way like that. Just so that the, cause I think the, that the, the amount of pipes that the water travels in the small pipes is like 10 or so. So it can cause some issues like you can see it's really light here whereas like down here it's super dark so it, it's not giving enough power or enough water uh, to those areas to travel that distance so they sh these should be fine uh, now and then we'll get uh, so I'm just gonna let start placing down these last bits and then I will join or we'll We'll come back to when it's all done. I'm also going to put in the light bulbs because that's kind of a tedious task as well. Uh, so you don't have to worry about that either. So I'll be right back. Welcome back, guys. So we did finish up uh, the stuff, and it took us like 16 days or so because I think it was 87. So it took us quite some time to get the, the stuff planned out, but I'm going to show you what I did. So all of this, like you saw, uh, with the water and... All of the electrical is done all of these small things are the light bulbs so we've done all of those now we're ready to start letting prisoners in so let's get the intake going and uh, fill capacity because we need it and we're also going to turn that on and then we also need a lot of guards and we're probably gonna stop at a hundred guards because we're getting like 300 prisoners so yeah 101 because I'm feeling kind of frisky we're also going to work on deployment which we can't do because we need something out of bureaucracy Let's go into bureaucracy. I've already done some of these, so don't like freak out because I, uh, because I did stuff without you guys like without showing you guys. The reason why I did is because we needed some of the stuff to do some of the labeling for uh, finishing up in the previous episode. So don't worry about that. But we are going to be needing deployment and intelligence. Uh, we're also going to do groundskeeping. Actually, we don't need groundskeeping as much as we need that stuff. Uh, we also need... Uh, let's do legal so we can get the small cells as well. And body armor tasers and then taser rollout we will do. We're not ready for guard towers just yet because... We haven't set up like a, a giant perimeter or even gotten like a yard going so there's not too much to worry about with that uh land expansion will be something we'll need later uh, extra grants mm, tax relief is going to be helpful as well and we're not doing too much with remote access or surveillance uh, i want 
I think I'm, I'm not, ne it's not necessary to get psychology right now. I just need this and we should be done in the next 30 seconds or so. And then I'll be able to deploy, deploy pr uh, guards to the areas in which I need them to be. I also want you guys. All of those. All 38 of you. And canine doges. Uh, getting you guys. Let's do 40 for now. Because uh, I don't know how many actual dog kennels we have. Uh, so let's do deployment guards. We need a bunch in there. We also want some in staff room just to make sure that they don't get too tired. And we're going to do that many in each of these. Right? That's. Throw three in each of these. One, three, four in each of these hallways because we're going to need guards just everywhere. Uh, we also want three in there, three in there. Actually, let's do four just in case uh, stuff happens in the visitation. Two in each of these. in those and two in each infirmary along with um, and then dog patrols we're going to set up one big dog patrol around the inside Circle. Along with... That, okay. And then we're also going to... some of these corners as well just get a couple of them in there and then we're also going to set up one big one around the outside and this will allow us to have just a dog patrol there which will in turn allow them to why why is there I don't know. And then <coughs> we are also going to set up armed patrols as well through here. So down here, there we go. And um, 
there's a lot more I want to do on the inside for like armed patrols and stuff like that, but I'm not too worried about that stuff right this minute as much as I am just trying to make sure that all of the cells and everything else are set up properly to, for food room quality. Quantity. Got it. Intelligence. Okay. And staff. Let's see here. Let's get three, five of those, the, those guys, and two more. Damn. Twenty five, six of those guys. A bunch of janitors. We need a lot of these guys. That should be fine. And twenty of these guys. Yeah. Just to make sure. I don't know why this is happening. Let's save real fast and load the prison Okay. Why is nobody going to the cells? Intelligence. Uh, staff only. should do it. That's new. Um, medium security, let's do those. Minimum there. There, there. Maybe. Or, or maybe do that and that. I don't, I, I don't really know. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know what's going on uh, and why they're all still outside. I mean, it's not like they're all still outside. I mean, there's a lot of them outside, yeah, but <laughs> that dump truck just ran over a bunch of people. Um, why is it that? Is it that we don't have enough uniforms to put them in? Because, I mean, there's a bunch of them just sitting right there.
Or do we just not have enough guards to fill out the deployments? Okay, so they are bringing them in now. It looks like they, that that was one of my issues. It's just going to take some time to get them into the prison. But, uh, yeah. But I, I think that's all I've got time for today. So I hope you guys did enjoy this one. If you did, please do remember to hit the like button uh, and show your appreciation for... Uh, for the series and I will see you guys in the next one until the next time do not forget to stay risky and I'll see you then